The best source for Windows 10 GTK theming files is the Boomerang Projects on GitHub release page. That is the light version, and though we'll use it as an example in this video, you can grab the Windows 10 Dark variant if you prefer. Links in the description. In the latest release card, download your Windows 10 theming by clicking source code. When the zip file download completes, you'll need to extract the contents. For a quick command line solution, first run this command in your home directory to create the folder in case it doesn't already exist. Follow that with the unzip command to decompress it and drop it in the themes folder. Just tweak the directory path and name for the file if yours is different. The basic theme package contains what you need to get the overall design of Windows 10, but if you want those illustrious icons, you need to get and install those separately. They're available from the same project, but in a separate icons repository. Link in the description. Unzip it like you did the theme pack but this time it is in the icons folder. With your theme and icons in place, it's time to paint the town windows. Open your DE's settings and look for its theming preferences, likely called appearance or, in the case of cinnamon, themes. The interface will look different depending on precisely your distro and DE. But in Cinnamon, there are three categories you can change to Windows, Applications, Icons, and Desktop. Click the button in each category to open the options.
The finishing touch is of course the classic Windows 10 background. There's a large collection of the older ones on Imager. I wanted the lighter blue version of the glass pane one, which I found at 4K wallpapers.